so today I finally got my Ipsy bag in the mail and I wanted to open it with you. So this is what our bag looks like. I think that this is by far the best bag that um that I've received from Ipsy. I think it's I just think it's really cool looking with the texture and all. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so this is the beautifully be of course. Now I can't say that word but home whatever. You know what it is. <laughs> it's like does that happen? Like you know how to say a word but then sometimes like you just can't like it won't come out of your mouth right. I don't know. Okay, so um I spent some of my Ipsy points on this NYX um was a soft matte lip cream and this is in I have no clue. I thought there was a fly in here, but somebody is uh congress. I don't know. Let's see if we can But it's just like this um peachy pink color and the whole deal that made me kind of upset is that Ipsy took away like a hundred of my points without even sending me an email or anything. So I almost had a thousand points until they took a hundred of them away. So that's kind of not cool. So let's open this up. Looks like that. Swatch it for you. Looks like that. I will put this on, but I'm like drinking soda out of a can, so. I got that with my Ipsy points. Okay, so I honestly wasn't going to check, but then I was like, where's my Ipsy bag? It's kind of late and it hasn't been here. So I did go on and check, and I was super excited to find out that I got a Julie G polish. Because where I live, you can't buy Julie G polishes except for like at Big Lots. So it came in this plastic thing. And this is called Damsel. And I'm pretty sure... Yes, I do not have this one. I do have Julie G polishes from like swaps and things. And from picking them up from Big Lots. And from when I have gone to a state that has... Um, a Rite Aid. It also came with a dollar off of... Any Jesse Girl or Julie G product at Rite Aid and expires on 531. Well, I probably won't be going to any state that has that. So this is just a really nice pink color and I will totally use this. I might use this today later when I paint my nails because they're freaking naked. Okay, next thing. This is all natural, tinted, handmade vegan um sorry mullen and sparrow lip and cheek balm Ooh, that is a dark color so let's let's see i think i would probably use this on my lips because actually the color even though the color is super dark, um, it's really not translating. It's right there. So, like, this would be a great lip balm or something. Is that what that says? A cheek? Lip and cheek balm. Yep, that's what it says. It's really hard to read. It's like teeny tiny words on there. But that's super cute. I will totally use that. Okay, the next thing is this Galani lipstick. It's really small and cute. And this is in the color Petal. Let's open it up. And yes, that is a color that I would wear. Let me swatch it right here for you. It's just like a nude pink color. Just like almost the color of my lips a little darker so that will be used for sure okay 
The next thing that is in here is this Micah Beauty Cosmetics. And this is an eye primer. I received an email saying that people had weird things in theirs. But um, Ipsy kind of reassured everybody that the bubbles and the little spots were caused by the cooling of this product so when they put it in this container it's hot and when um when it cools down sometimes there's bubbles in it so that's why so it's just an eye primer which i will totally use put that right there um skin color is right here you can't really see it so I don't know how well it works or anything. So then the last thing I was super excited for. It is the Nude Dude. And this is a mini eyeshadow by The Balm. And all their packaging I think looks super cute. But I have yet to buy anything from them. Just because I have so much. So I don't know. Okay. The one that I got is this dude and the color is fit so let's see this is a color that I would use obviously because it's from the nude dude I would to oh my god yeah you can't see how shiny that is but freaking that is like super oh there we go that's super pretty yeah I am actually really pleased with this Ipsy bag. The only thing I'm kind of ticked off about is that they took my points without sending me a notification that my points were going to expire or anything like that. And I'm super happy that I got the Julie G because I love those nail polishes. I only wish that I could use this, but I can't because I do not have a Rite Aid. I feel like I miss out on that. Like the LA girl, I know that they're sold at Rite Aid, Jesse, Jesse's girl, and Julie G. Okay, any we can be done with my complaining about living in a city that doesn't have a Rite Aid. And I think this is super cute. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.